Hey everybody, I'm back again with another video. This time I'm doing a tutorial on schism for Dimitriology. Let's go! Set up in Demetriology, you have to go into the Demetriology wizard again. Now, that wizard is still set up with the old code, so the first steps in getting a new code is going back to the website. And I showed you how to do that in my last video, but I will show you again. You have to make sure you go to the correct website, so write this one down, and then go to it on your web page should look like this and you just have to pull out the new code because it will not allow you to modify the existing or add any new builds until you have this code and it updates every hour um, so it's randomly generated so you cannot uh, use this code for your build because it will be dead by the time you see this video Okay, so you got to go to settings and then you have to select your code and just wipe out the old code and put in your new code. So I generally put it on a notepad, but you can even write it on a piece of paper. Now the uh, first error I made was that I tried to install Demetriology uh, new build over an existing build. That will mess up and error out. So you have to make sure that you do a fresh install first. So you do fresh start. And once you click on that, it's gonna tell you that it's gonna delete everything except for the wizard. And then you can go back and after the fresh install, you can reinstall and the code will actually remain also. So if you wanna do it in that order, you still can now. I'm going to be able to go through the schism no problem without any errors. So once this thing completes, you should see the new schism build fully installed and you will have to close it out and restart Cody. So once that's restarted, then you'll see the new build added in there. So let's close it out. And as you can see here, I'm in the new build. I'm testing a bunch of stuff. Now, the thing I noticed during the testing phase was that the actual um, Exodus and the lot and Phoenix and a lot of other ones weren't installed by default. So you, I will show you how to do that later in the uh, testing phase because I actually had to find it. It's a, another location that has that, but I just wanted to show real quick this new um, show that I found while I was testing called Bitchin' Rides. It's a really cool show. I uh, kind of liked it, so I wanted to bring it up and show you guys real quick. Obviously, I'm not gonna play any sound, and I'm gonna play it fast so that it I don't get any copyright hits, but it's it's a pretty cool show once you get it working and it does take a little bit to stream but once you get it going it works fine there it goes so real quickly i'm not sponsored by m m's but they make a coffee one now that is totally awesome i don't know if anybody has tried these things but leave a comment if you have they're awesome So I started to search and look for Exodus and I couldn't find it for nothing and I, I thought maybe if I install Indigo that didn't work. Then I noticed back in the settings within the Demetriology wizard that there is a spot that tells you to enable all the add-ons. So if you go back into the wizard it will show you that the add-ons are not enabled. So after searching for a while, I found it. And if you look at the very almost second to the bottom, it says Cody fix. 
or 17. So I guess there's an issue when you're first putting this version of the build. It might not put all of the uh, add-ons on there. So you'll have to reboot Cody again and then launch it and you should now have Exodus and Phoenix TV and all those other good ones. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun making it and hopefully it was informative and it helped you guys get this installed. Let me know in the comments if you guys like this build and if you want me to do more videos like this. Subscribe if you want to catch more tutorial videos and much more. Anyway, that's my video. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna get the tech out of here. Thanks again.